in HD from the station that brings you more West Texas news. News West 9 at 10 starts now. We're now about two months away from the start of Jade Helm, a large scale military exercise that sparked widespread fear. Officials insist most of that fear is irrational. Tonight, Julia Dang clears up the latest rumors for us. A foreign invasion, martial law, something cooked up by Walmart. Let's go, boys. Mayor of Big Spring, Larry McClellan, has heard it all. He's gotten thousands of emails about Jade Helm conspiracy theories. You aren't competent as a mayor. When the f is it ever okay to allow the federal government to perform no knock raids in your town? In reality, Army officials say Jade Helm 15 is just a special ops training exercise. I had no idea that there would be any uproar whatsoever. A top concern is whether or not people will be moved from their homes in order to make room for troops. I don't think we're going to have people kicked out of their homes. I don't think we're going to have people knocking on the door in the middle of the night. But he says the military is paying people to use their property for Jade Helm. They have contracted with some ranchers in the area to uh, utilize their property for drills and uh, war tactics and things like that. Military officials didn't return our calls. It's not clear how many homeowners are being paid to move and how much money they're getting. I support our troops, but when they're trying to take over civilians, uh, that ain't cool. That's their homes. You know, that's where they live. But the mayor says there is something positive coming out of Jade Helm that everybody in Big Spring should be happy about. Guaranteed economic stimulation across a number of different industries. Wherever they're training could see as much as 150,000 increase in sales. He confirmed troops will be buying groceries and other supplies locally. Any little influx into our small town of Big Spring would be welcome. Mayor McClellan wants to clarify the money is being pumped into the economy, not his own pocket. That's another rumor. I've had a call that that we were paid $150,000. He says that's not true. Absolutely no compensation. Believe what you will about Jade Helm, but it's set to kick off July 15th. Julia Dang, News West 9.